And finally, for today's program, let's turn to David Trim for a look at Adventist history. This week, learn about early Adventist missionaries who served in Ecuador. Welcome to This Week in Adventist History. On November 7, 1905, George W. Case Beer, a native of Iowa, arrived with his wife Mary in Ecuador. They were just the second and third Adventist missionaries to Ecuador, and George was the first ordained Adventist minister in the country. He became superintendent of the newly organized Ecuador mission. The first convert in the country was baptized just over 18 months later in 1907. And 108 years later, there are 60,000 Seventh-day Adventists in Ecuador. On November 11 in 1955, John F. Hunegaard passed away, aged 79. Christened Johann Friedrich Hunegaard, he was born in 1875 in Russia to a German family which emigrated to the U.S. state of Kansas when he was a child. Aged 22, he went back to Europe as a missionary. That was in 1897, and the following year was sent to work in Hungary. You see him here from a photo taken for his passport renewal in 1913. In 1900, John had married Eliza Buchanan, and they served as missionaries in Hungary and neighboring countries until 1919. John served there as a conference and a union president. He later served as secretary of the North American Foreign Language Department at the General Conference from 1925 to 1929, when the Hunigarts returned to Europe as missionaries. John served as president of the Yugoslavian Union for six years. They returned to the U.S. finally in 1936, where John pastored German-speaking churches in California until the age of 74. In addition, for 34 years, from 1921 until shortly before his death, he edited the North American Division's German Language Journal. And as a colleague recalled, throughout the 1940s, John and Eliza spent countless hours in preparing packages of food and clothing to be sent to the needy in Europe. Hunegaard was a giant of Adventist mission in Eastern Europe. That was this week in Seventh-day Adventist history. Music 